हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू सुरेश अग्रवाल्स मैथमेटिक्स शॉर्टकट्स यू वन स्टॉप फॉर लर्निंग ऑल द मैथमेटिक्स शॉर्ट ट्रिक्स फॉर स्मार्ट कैलकुलेशंस दैट इज फास्ट ट्रिक्स फास्ट कैलकुलेशन ट्रिक्स आर ए मस्ट इफ यू वांट टू क्रैक एनी टाइप ऑफ क्वांटिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड एग्जाम और इफ यू आर ए स्कूल स्टूडेंट एंड यू वॉन्ट टू यू नो बी वन अमॉन्ग दोज वन परसेंट स्टूडेंट्स हु कैन थिंक अबाउट नंबर्स स्मार्टली देन दिस चैनल इज फॉर यू एंड talking about the short tricks i am going to take up this amazing video in this particular uh, you know session where we will be finding the fourth root of number uh, this will be a short trick you know you may call it a short trick or a smart method and if you want to learn all these short tricks at one place then we have this super super combo this super combo of quantitative aptitude which is you know must for all the government competitive exams and ntsc imo at school level and the reasoning this is something which everybody should study right from the basic level itself so whether you are a school student or anybody who is preparing for a government competitive exam this super combo of quant and reasoning will help you a great deal in understanding how to succeed in these exams so we have this ebook where we have over 350 short tricks in this particular ebook then 24 different topics covered 300 neatly typed pages video support this is something special if you don't understand something click and watch the video fully solved and develops 10 times faster speed of calculations all types of quantitative aptitude uh, you know syllabus covered in this and then we have the reasoning course 18 different topics covered in this neatly typed concepts illustrations and practice questions also some previous year questions also given there with answer key video support directory to enhance your understanding so friends grab a copy of this amazing course i tell you this is going to be a very very important uh, collection for you and you can refer to it any time currently we are giving unlimited validity printable form of these ebooks so This is my WhatsApp number nine eight nine six three six double nine six three. Jot it down and send me a message on WhatsApp now to grab a copy. Whether you are a school student or a college student or an aspirant of a government competitive exam, nine eight nine six three six double nine six three. That's the number. Let's see the question in hand now. Here we have the question: the fourth root of six five five three six. So how are you going to find it? Now this actually is. not easy that's because you know when you have to crack these type of questions you need to think very very smartly so how are you going to do it will you use the prime factorization method i think that's the only method which most of the students will know when they have to find fourth root of something without the use of calculator it's really impractical to use the prime factorization method because this is a five digit number and making prime factors can be a huge task so when the number given here this number 65536 is a perfect fourth power then you can find it smartly and you should know that whenever there is a fourth power what do you mean by fourth power of some number you know this suppose i write fourth root of x fourth root of x means x raised to power 1 by 4 and that means it is x raised to power 1 by 2 raised to power 1 by 2 and what is x raised to power 1 by 2 it is root x so root x power 1 by 2 means square root of root x so if you can understand this then i think finding the fourth root will be easy how we have to find the square root of this number 65536 two times that will give you the fourth root of 65536 so to find the square root we have the amazing methods which are mentioned in the ebook of short tricks let's see this here we have the pair of numbers from the right hand side this is 36 what is the use of this 36 this 36 will tell you the unit digit of the square root of 65536 which is either 4 or 6 because 4 square ends in 6 and 6 square also ends in 6 now here we have another pair and a single digit that means you will have two digits before 4 or before 6 now what are those two digits the entire number here is 655 and 655 is greater than 25 square see 25 square is 625 
and if you take 26 square it will be 676 that will be greater than 655 i just want a number just below uh, you know 655 the, the square should the, of that number should lie below 655 so that is 25 so i'll write 25 here on 25 here so the square root of this big number is either 254 or 256 now there are two methods through which you can find which one is the correct answer one you can actually find the square root of the intermediate number that is 255 can you find 255 square orally i can you know why because i am aware of the physics maths tricks so 25 times 26 this is what you need to do 26 times 25 so 2600 half of that is 1300 half of that is 650 so this will be 650 so the square of this number is 650 followed by 25 now my number 65536 is greater than this and therefore my answer will be the greater one 256 so the first square root that means this part is 256 and now i need to find another square root so square root of 256 which is pretty elementary now you know the square root of 256 i am sure because you should know the squares of at least first 30 natural numbers this is 16 and your answer for the question is 16 just take fourth root of 65536 will be 16 you know whatever i have written here friends this is just for understanding sake to make you understand that this is not a difficult job but you don't have to write everything when i do it for myself i would write only about 10 percent of these steps rest everything is mental maths so friends very important that you realize the importance of short tricks and study from the ebook of short tricks so here we go this video is to be shared by all of you i'm sure you must be uh, you know sharing these videos and helping the educators do subscribe the channel if you have not done till now and click the bell shift icon for getting the notifications thanks for watching this video and all the best